So it's all settled. I start back on Monday. So that gives me two days to finish two weeks worth of filing and timesheets. Just joking, everything is how you would like it. Good girl. Morning. Now, oh, Lawrence. Look, I need some reports typed up. What do I do? Uh, oh, Cliff from admissions can help you. Yeah, but I want the best. It's you, isn't it, Nancy? Hey, I didn't realize you were coming in this morning. I oh, want just to catch up with who are you. Okay, I should probably get going, but I'm glad everything's okay. Wonderful change of attitude, but boy, that outfit. Boy, bait. Long story, but listen, I've been to the jewelers. Oh, did you get the money for the ring? No, three o'clock. But I did get this. Mm. Oh, my Lord. You think Sarah will like it? It's stunning. But Hamish, it must have cost you a bomb. Uh, worth every cent. Like you say, there's nothing like spoiling someone special. <laughs> I can't wait to see your face. Oh, I wish I could be there. I thought a lot last night about what you said. And I don't want to give up the job. I think I am management material. Saying it's one thing, Tony, I know. but... I have to make some changes. I've been erratic in my approach to staff, and that hasn't worked. No, it hasn't. Uh, you carry on. We'll review this again at a later date. Um, Tony, can I talk to you about changing shifts? I was hoping to... I'm not taking verbal requests anymore. If you want to change shifts or apply for leave, fill in the forms. You know where they are. OK, um, sorry, I was just... Oh, it's OK. I just want things done by the book. So, oh, I guess Huya was pretty ticked off about the whole mere thing yesterday. I behaved unprofessionally. I apologise. I was pretty bratty myself. It's not like it was that big a deal. It was for me. Don't say that. It all got a bit heavy. I just got carried away. Well, it's over now, so let's just leave it. No, but Huya's on your case. I'm sorry. I, I said leave I can... it. You've probably done me a favour anyway. Meaning what? You're meant to be in ED. If you see Claire, can you tell her I'm still waiting on those files? What time are you coming in on Monday? Eight o'clock, I think we said. Only I checked and I'm not due until ten. But I can come in early and get you up to speed. Well, if you're sure you don't mind. Oh, sorry. Oh, man, I'm such a klutz. Oh, I'll grab those. No, it's okay. I'll get them. Ten bucks says she's wasting her time. Well, Hamish said something about Claire being boy bait. I see what he means now. Mm -hmm. Well, I really can't chat. Tony's waiting for these files. But hey, do you want to do a movie after work? You up for that, buddy? <laughs> um, sure, why not? Cool. See you on Monday. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I think you might have just scored yourself a lazy ten up. Poor Baxter. <laughs> I enjoyed that. Felt like you were cutting me some slack at last. Sorry? Well, things were a bit tense there when you found out I'd applied for CEO. <clears throat> That's the thing, Lawrence. I found out. You didn't tell me. Well, I thought if I had, you'd have decided again snapping me up. Oh, I understand. Who is a friend? She's also an in-house contender. I felt I wanted my chance to see things from the inside. To even the playing field. Seemed reasonable. You should have told me, out of simple courtesy. I wonder what you'd have done in my position. Well, I've never applied for a desk job before. I always felt the world was better served while I was using these. Yeah, I tried the desk. Didn't suit me. Not now, perhaps, but sometime later when the time comes. Like it has for you? <laughs> You've seen the last of my glory days in here. Not that I'm retiring. I've got too much to offer, too much passion for what we do, just like your father. <laughs> yeah, retirement was a dirty word. Because he had vision and an energy to make things happen. When I look around Shortland Street, I don't see it as it is now. I see it as a world-class surgical centre, streamlined, highly productive, a place where doctors like you... <laughs> that damn soapbox keeps slipping under my feet. I'm boring you. No, you're not. Actually, um, what are you doing for dinner tonight?
Shot, mate. Boy. 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 Brilliant. Yeah, they do. Good. Whoops. What's the matter, Craigie? Can't you hack the pace? No, no, just giving the younger guys a go. Wouldn't want to show them up for the whole game. Oh, that's thoughtful. How was dinner with the mother-in-law? Yvonne is not my mother-in-law. She's never going to be. Does Hamish know that? You see, Craig, not all men are as desperate as you to rush in and play happy families. We're just having fun. Get it, get it, get it! Oh, oh, hey! You see, the game's holding up. Now you're off the field. Oh, man. <laughs> Next to you, knowing the ball! Whoa! Oh. Now you've got me, God boy. What are you going to do with me? Oi! Sub! 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 Sub!